The Legend of the Elang Elang. At the beginning, when the sky and the earth had just parted, most of the plants only had leaves without any flowers. The Jade Emperor ordered the God of Beauty to embellish the earth. Obeying the order, the God of Beauty took with her the magic brush and the decanter of scents, heading to the earth. She painted with all her love for every creature on earth. Soon after, the grounds and gardens were covered with the colorful, lovely flowers. The brush had accomplished its tasks, but there were not enough fragrances for all the flowers. Thinking for a while, the god decided that she would only give the kindest flowers the precious scents. She asked the rose, "What would you do if you were to be blessed with a beautiful scent?" I would ask Sister Wind to give it to everybody. Satisfied with the answer, the god of beauty gave the rose a strong, sweet fragrance. She asked the lotus, "What would you do if you were to be blessed with a beautiful scent?" The lotus inclined her head and replied modestly, "I would use it." To spread the seed of kindness into every soul, the god, with pleasure, gave the lotus a delicate fragrance. She asked the milk flower, "What would you do if you were to be blessed with a beautiful scent?" I would fill up the air with my scent, so that I would be recognized even in the dark. Though the god was not totally satisfied. She still decided to give her an immensely strong fragrance. She asked the hibiscus, "What would you do if you were to be blessed with a beautiful scent?" I already have such a radiant red. With the fragrance, I would be the best of all. The god sighed. I walked away. As time went by, she bestowed the fragrance upon different flowers. Finally, there was only one scent left. The goddess of the scents, still the god of beauty, hadn't found the flower that deserved to have it. Suddenly, she saw pure white petals hiding behind the leaves. She hastily asked her, "Elang, Elang." What would you do if you were to be blessed with a beautiful scent? The Elang Elang hesitated a little bit and then replied, "I would be very much grateful, but I would rather you give it to the grass." You dare to refuse my favor? The flower burst into tears. Unless I grow up high, I am equal to other flowers. Flowers of the grass are stepped on. They are not respected by others. They need to be compensated. Moved by what the Elang Elang said, she told the flower, "Little Elang Elang, you truly deserve your beautiful, pure white and this magical fragrance. I'm going to give you. Keep this pure scent and use it well to spread the love among all the creatures on earth." Before going back to heaven, the god even gave grass his holy breath, that brought about strength and flexibility, which kept the grass stand strong before any violent trample. Even until now, the Elang Elang still cherishes the blessed fragrance. When the summer comes, its little petals timidly open up to spread the beautiful fresh scent. The scent that can even soften the blazing sunlight, and despite being small, the Elang Elang is sometimes considered the goddess of the flowers.